Yo YouTube, what's going on today guys? Welcome back to the channel, it is Ricar here and I have a very interesting topic that I just wanna to touch on for you guys today and I want your guys' opinion on it, all the good stuff. It seemed like we had some really good conversations in yesterday's video about skill-based matchmaking. So I did wanna reach out on something that was brought up in those topics along with something that has been kind of in the community now for a little bit too long and we haven't really heard Treyarch talk about it yet and that is reverse boosting and we're gonna jump into that here in just a second but if you guys are liking these general conversations that I'm having with you guys I'm taking all your guys' input trying to make the community of mine like a family in a way and I like hearing what you guys have to say and getting to know you guys so if you guys do like these videos make sure you do subscribe to the channel comment something below because I am really wanting to get to know you guys and let's like the video guys if you guys can get these videos to like 50 likes it does help me out so I appreciate y'all let's jump on into it alrighty guys I put a little music on for you guys a little bit of gameplay in the background so you guys can enjoy them other than hearing my ugly voice so guys we have something we need to talk about this is a non-reverse gameplay by the way non-reverse boosting gameplay like i don't know why i even have to say that but since we're talking about it i just want to like let you guys disclaimer like this is just normal gameplay for me i would never reverse boost because why would you ever want to play against someone that has like never used a controller before but it is what it is guys so what reverse boosting is for anyone that hasn't heard of it is essentially you throw your games for like four to eight games in a row even like you can throw more the more you throw your games the worse players are going to play against so have you guys had someone in your games yet that literally is just killing themselves with c4 on your team i have and the guy I, on my team and one of the games that i was in it's happened in multiple of them but the guy was like 0 and 62 on our team and just shooting rpgs and throwing c4 on the ground and killing himself over and over and obviously we lost the game because we were down a player and you know, no matter how good you play and you if you're playing against somewhat decent people like i do with my skill based matchmaking bracket it's pretty hard to win so not only is that person screwing me over in that game they are going ahead and this person on my team i wish i had the gameplay here for you but his clan tag like i have in mine in game is yt youtube so i know this guy was going in to kill himself over and over so he could play against worse players and make youtube content what is fun about that content can you guys explain that to me because if you guys like that content maybe i should start doing it just kidding i would never do that but what is fun about that for me personally as someone that has played call of duty for 13 years guys like probably more than 13 years at this point like i know if someone's good at call of duty you don't have to come in out and like drop a 150 kill game where you're playing against literally people that don't look like they've never used their controller before like go give your controller mouse and keyboard over to your wife girlfriend significant other sister younger brother that's four years old go give that to them and see what they look like trying to use a controller for the first time those are the players that you get to play against when you reverse boost and reverse boosting content to me is incredibly obvious and super boring to watch but guys why are we doing this why are people doing this that clout 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 is everything in this world nowadays and that's how people make money and unfortunately that is like that's really what it is so this has been going on for people trying to get nukes people trying to set world record kills people in warzone trying to set high kill games in warzone be like i dropped a 40 kill game in warzone guys but the people i played against didn't do anything so it's like it's really obvious and i don't know why you would ever do it but guys i really want to hear your guys's point on this because is that fun is that fun to watch someone drop like 40 kills and not even shoot back like you can tell when someone has good movement like you watch any pro player you watch my content like i'm not saying i'm a pro player i play against pro players and i've played at high levels of call of duty for a long time but like you can just tell when someone's movement like i can literally watch someone move as a player and tell you like how good of a player they are it's really obvious because you won't see them do the obvious thing like you'll see like if you're thinking in your head like oh this person's gonna go right and they go right you're like all right this person might not be that good but if they fake right go left and then go back right you're like hmm this man knows what he's doing and when you're playing reverse boost lobbies you're just never going to play against anyone that can compete with you so that is the last thing i did want to talk 
touch on today for you guys because it is stupid that people are going out of their way to reverse boost like why would you ever reverse boost in general guys like i don't know why anyone would do it please let me know down in the comments what you guys are thinking about this because if you're making youtube content and doing that why the heck would you ever do it Ugh. but i appreciate you guys if you guys did like the video make sure you do subscribe to the channel like the video and comment below what you guys are thinking about this like i said i like to get to know you guys get your guys' opinions and go on from there so i appreciate y'all have a wonderful rest of your day and peace out